post I don't wanna look back What my life was like before I just took a red eye penthouse Pop flow In the stew I got a spaz out Back up in my Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back. Uh, today I will be making the tutorial on the Edit Like Sovio video that I did a couple of weeks ago, I think. And that if I hit 175 subs, I will be making a tutorial on it. So uh, yeah, that's what I will be doing today. And um, yeah, let's just get to it. Um, first, you wanna unlink the clips so we can add the velocity. And I'm gonna do that with... Twixter. If you don't have uh, Twixter installed, um, I can't say it to you, but if you're smart, you will look in my Discord server. Um, Alright, so once you've done that, just go in here and go to the frame where you want the slow motion to start. I want it to start right after the ramp edited, so right about here, I think. Just place a keyframe, go on ahead place this to 20 then go to this where you put your marker uh, on where the kill happens without the slow-mo go fry 5 frames back 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 place a keyframe go back again and then you want to drag this all the way up until you get the kill so right there yeah then go 1, 2 frames ahead and change this to 30 and yeah that's the velocity basically yeah it's that easy with Twixter so just gonna cut it down uh, uh, just like that uh, 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 just like that alright so right where the first keyframe comes, you want to cut the clip and do it here. Just cut that. Then drag it up. Oh. Drag it up. Just like that. So you have two clips. Then you want to mask it, but I already have it masked in After Effects. So, alright, so once you have it masked right here, um, the next thing you want to do is open it in the fusion page go into presets and I will of course have the preset linked in the description just uh, delete the displays and connect these and the um, brightness hue set bright I use the is uh, minus point eighty nine um, so once you do that, um, you want to just maybe turn down the glow noise a little bit. Uh, yeah, this should be fine. And then next thing you want to do is um, do go 10 frames ahead. You can see it's at 48. It's just it's because it's really laggy. I don't want to ruin it or something. Um, just go to 58. Oh wait gotta place a keyframe on the opacity then go 10 frames, a 10 frames ahead change this to maybe I don't know 50 let's say 50 um, and you wanna do the same thing for the mask 10 frames ahead so it's kinda like fades in alright so the next thing you wanna do is um, the shockwave that uh, I used in the video as well uh, I have it in here um, it's this one right here yeah and then you want just want to do it like this and what you want to do is go into the composite mode change that to add and as you can see it masked out for you um, so that's kind of it for the um, for the mask and the the shockwave itself and next thing is to add an impact and I have an overrated impact ready here just like that 
and as you can see it's perfect and you also want to add a pre-shake and um, so that's it for the impact itself uh, you could also add shockwave oh no shockwave, shotgun um, I have one in the run right here one two three four frames ahead I will have this linked in the description too if you want to use it uh, just the volume is up to you because it's up to you what sounds best I like to have it at minus five minus six something like that and I will get I have a password here as well just I want to go ahead here and find right about um, yeah here I would say yep and go and place that there change it to maybe 1.5 and then you have a nice password as well alright so the next thing I want to do is um, the ident and the VHS um, like the one uh, Soviet uses um, so what you want to do is find like a beat in the song or something so I have one right here right there and I just wanna uh, oh wait just wanna drag in my ident um, I have that here just like that just like that and I like to do a little fade in and just want to do like this and just kinda like mess with it I think uh, 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 yeah I guess that's fine alright so then you want to cut the clip and go in here and I will have a preset for this too um, I have uh, I just gotta find it right here oh that's the wrong one wanna make sure you go into the right clip because like if this is above and you press fusion it's gonna go into this you wanna go into the clip right here go into fusion and drag it on and as you can see it's very good um so you want to one go like ten frames one two three four five oh and one two four five six seven eight nine ten there's opacity and change this to five maybe then um what you want to do is just drag that down and once you anyway um one two let's do it like that and go in here and change this to one and there you have a good beat shake and yeah that is kind of it for the um, the ident VHS combination thing um, you could also add just for it to look a little bit better you could add a uh, lens blur uh, it's, it's in the B BCC plugins oh. um, you want first just to add an adjustment clip oh wait that's not gonna f*** up the effect oh it's fine um, go in here and search up lens blur oh that's not it this one oh that's not it yeah 
just to go in here and um, I think I don't know if this you can play a little with it but I think it's a little bit too much I can't lie um, just go I don't know 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 22, 23, 24, 25 frames ahead, I would say. And uh, just keep on this. And just like that. And change this to zero. Oh, wait. Oh, that's, that's fine. Yeah. And oh, gotta change this. So yeah, that's it. Yeah, maybe turn this down to twelve. That's fine. All right, I think that's it. If I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Thank you so much for watching guys, really means a lot, and I will see you in the next video.